Hey folks. It's a fine Wednesday afternoon. Twitch.tv Bread Machine Go. And um Yeah, we're doing some more 3D stuff today. Hope everybody's having a good week so far. Let's get stream laptars happening and we could put, put a couple uh Now. Looks like Stream Avatar has got an update. I don't think we have to worry about it though. Chats up there, that's looking good. actually get my files open that would be if we're gonna do some work let's actually have some files to work on sensible choice I think I think I think I think no not there I'm pretty sure this is the more recent version yeah Harpy with cool hairdo. Hairdo Harpy. I was looking around on the to-do list from uh, Mr. Steak Z Z Z Z Z, um, and they had a hippo marked it as high priority. We haven't sketched a hippo yet, so we'll probably get that going today once we get the harpy in order. Hands up channels. And I just wanted to bother that Facebook group too, and they'll be good to go. Off to the races, as they say. hair a little bit more that little side cloth also the head on this is a lot bigger I was noticing when I was comparing the screenshots so I think we're gonna first actually let's let's get the hair going in the shape that we want and then we'll make the head a little bit bigger get all the, the quads and faces doing what we want it to do Right? I think that's reasonable. Let's find out. Let's find out if it is or it isn't. 
Oh man, I've got some water. I just ate a bunch of chocolate. You look good. <laughs> Look a little bit, a little bit like an edgy harpy. Edgy harpy. Yeah, he's pretty. Uh, he's pretty. That's what we're going for. He's, he's pretty, pretty svelte. I don't think he's gonna have a part in the middle. It's gonna have like a big side, whoosh, big side over, over the side. I think it might look a little emo. You know what I mean? You know, like an emo bird. Yeah. I think that's where we're headed. bird. Oh, and I don't have enough vertices. I did it again. I had a feeling that was going to happen. Yeah. doing well. <laughs> A large VHS collection. That's sad. <laughs> Harpy with Harpy with VHS tapes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. I like it though. Can't relate to that, sorry. Oh shit. <laughs> I could. We could we could go there. If anybody has any haircut recommendations? Generous though. Okay. And like such. We'll see. Missing something critical. It's not actually a face. I think we're okay. I was getting illusioned. Yeah, no, that's yeah, Mr. Mr. Daytrix or whatever. He's definitely like uh, Harpy's uncle. I, think I was thinking about it. I've been thinking about it. I must admit. How much more of that? How much more of that? 
that. Here we go. Power P. That's a good way to put it. Things to look, o look forward to when you're older, I guess. Peeing while you laugh, laughing while you pee. I guess, like, they're not mutually exclusive. Ouch. Ouch. It's like tiny little face pains. Older, sure. Like when, you're, when you age and you lose, uh, and you lose all of your good bladder control, if you lose that. Go anywhere without my diaper. That's pretty good. I have a tumbler I want to show you. <laughs> pretty good. Pretty good at that. <laughs> you probably already know it. That's okay. Ah ha ha. All right, Harpy boy. just, you know, two by two, like two, 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 we had, if there was a way to make a little bit of hair in the middle, off to the side, I think like this, I think if we do this it'll go a long way, have one little kind of base in the middle, we can extrude out, it'll be a little different, it'll be a little different. <laughs> totally natural, <laughs> extremely natural, right? The naturalness of the look is what we're all about here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for giving me the permission. some of those, hide some of that. It's always facing the normals, the, the way that I do not wish to. Beginning, that's interesting. It just has something to do with how we are doing something, I'm not really sure. Kirby Tunes! Josh, what do you got? <laughs> That's a cute pen. <laughs> My heart beat. What if you had a pen that wrote with P instead of ink? Consider that. <laughs> what if? Brace for what I'm about to tell you. <laughs> what if? In a world where pens write with ink. <laughs> Kinda 
kind of looked like pee. What a trick. What a trick to play on an unsuspecting artist. It's one weird trick. One weird trick artists hate. When <laughs> you trade them ink for pee. <laughs> ah, we hate that trick! <laughs> I'm so sick of that trick. Damn it, not again! Always the same. <laughs> Gets me every time. I can't remember who was saying who was saying it the other day about how Kirby music made them anxious, but I kind of like I really like it. I love how active it is. It's got this undeniable charm to it, too. Do 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 do. We're gonna make them a little bit thinner in the top. Give us some some of that shape. Kirby tunes. Yeah, I don't even know. I don't know if I've played NES Kirby. So many games to play. So many. Ah, oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so excited. Ow. I'm so excited to say ow. Uh, okay, cool. So this one. It's... I'm liking this. I'm liking this. Big, solid shape, chunky hair. It's a little bit like looking in a mirror. <laughs> Almost done with the Axiom Verge. Oh man, you've been working on that for some time. Jeez, yeah. I can't. I can't 100% games. I just can't do it. Except for you know. Yeah, I don't. Even, I don't know. I don't even have a condition to add on to that. I can't think of a game that I 100%ed. I feel like I could do something with Monster Hunter. Whole mess of achievements or something. But... We want to do this guy. Nooks and crannies, crooks and nannies. Grow home. That's cool. So let's connect that to there. Yeah, it's a little bit laughing in a strange way. Do, 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 do. This one's gonna be different because it's kind of in the middle. Doesn't follow the same rules. Tell you what, let's just make this curl a lot lower and give us more room to work with. Crooks and nannies. Ah, Juhashi, that sounds kind of awful, but cool. Yeah. Stuff happening randomly is kind of fun on paper, but also, you know, sort of, like, if I can't repeat it as a player, or if I can't give someone the conditions to repeat it, Reliably, to me that's kind of like iffy design. I don't really like that. I like for people to be able to, you know, say like, wow, I discovered this. This is how I did it. And then it's sort of documentable. And it's a secret, and the secret's out, but... You know, random is, random is something that, you know, people kind of say, oh, this will be great, but then... It's kind of weird design space to actually dwell in. Ooh, that's a funny guy. 
funny guy. Look at that funny guy. Funny guy. I'm kind of digging this new sort of extrude out extrude out a line method and uh, get the shape there. It does happen a little bit. I mean, um, with the help portals and things. But, uh, yeah, it's, you know, and it's it's not necessarily the best thing. All the, it's, I wouldn't want to rely on it for gating a bunch of content. It's okay in doses. But even something like the... I don't know, going going to hell sort of the normal way by the by using the jibbering things where you just kind of stand next to them and don't shoot. That's that's something where you can say, yeah, go to this enemy, let the display fuzz out, and don't attack it. Just stay there. That's sort of what I would say is that's actually good design. Yeah. I'm sure it works. I'm sure it works. But it also makes me wonder, are there things that you can do to sort of make it more likely that one of these things will happen? I don't know. Gets me curious. That's okay. Yeah, Pickle Surprise. Pickle Surprise. That's nice. I think we can all get behind Pickle Surprise. <laughs> That's the surprise. Thanks for the Just a little bit. Ah, man. Just doing. You would like stuff at the gym today, and it made my knee hurt. Tender bones. That we did it. A beautiful, beautiful hair shape. Make it smooth. Make it. It's got auto smoothing. Cool. Nice. An actual screen, as opposed to one of those TVs. TVs without a screen. But that's good though. I was going to offer you a spare TV if we had, or a spare TV we had, but it sounds like you've already made arrangements. So that's good. Yeah. Television, no television. Just a little television. Just a little television. It's looking beautiful. It looks like looks like half of the baristas I've met. Charming. Good people. I kinda wanna have one more little hair thing in front. Just to cover up that middle part. 
That might be nice. Let's let's finish this up first. Yeah, or I have two I have two CRTs at home. I don't know. One of them you might need a universal remote, but I might be able to help you out there too. Just to, so many so many dumb attic TVs. Too many tanks. Too many tanks. I would like to do some things for my attic. I think it is easy. But then again, I haven't really tried. All this TV, all this TV stuff makes me happy that the RetroPie is just an HDMI out. So nice, so nice. Little RetroPie. It just works out on the same thing. I need to, uh, I need to learn how to <laughs> pair the Bluetooth controller that I got to it again because I definitely forgot how. <laughs> <laughs> and I just try and try and it doesn't work and I wonder what did I do wrong? What a fool I have been. So I think they just released a some kind of Kirby game for the Switch, but I was seeing sort of iffy reviews on it. I'm not sure. It was confusing. I remember reading the Polygon review on it, and they're saying, you know, oh, it seems like kind of a short game for the amount of money they're charging. And then somebody, and it was like a perfect internet moment. Where somebody in the comments was saying, yeah, I was playing the demo, it was really short. I don't understand why they would charge so much money for this. And then somebody replied to the comment in like a super snarky way, saying, you were playing the demo. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh. Left to our own devices, we're just gonna pitch each other into oblivion. But yeah, that was cool. <laughs> it's called the demo for a reason. Some, some such bullshit. Kind of, it was kind of impressive. This one is, this one looks like a strange co-op something something, so I can't really tell. You know, we might not need all the hair, hair gons back here. Fishtail! What's happening, bud? Kirby 64 Crystal Shards. What was so good about it? I'm not saying it like a, like, what was so good about it, like, genuinely, what was good about it? How did we do 
you on our account. Crystal Shards. 3D Kirby? Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, you do have an N64 now. Or you had an N64. It just came out of... Or no, it is your new N64, because your old N64 went away. I remember things. I remember things. I have a memory. I have a memory. I have a memory. I can remember things. I have a good memory. Rememberly. <laughs> Fish tail, it's okay. Classic games like that, you can discuss. You can discuss the OP strats, we don't mind. It's fine, really. I'm really resisting looking up juicy details about uh, Devil Joe weaknesses. Gotta resist the juicy deeds. Cause I kinda just wanna I kinda just wanna fight him and maybe get get faced a couple times and see how that goes. Snowflake of Destruction sounds like a cool book title talking about like 2016, 2017, 2018 politics. <laughs> it does. I think we're into some jingles. Snowflake of destruction. <laughs> oh shit. We need some other music. NES Ninja Gaiden, is that any good? Let's find out. <laughs> Frozen 2. Frozen 2. all these, um, you know, these Disney masterpieces. What is going on? What's going on? Something is up. So we're getting to watch all these Disney masterpieces and having to, like, kind of sit through them. And, but meanwhile, I'm kind of watching them with my critical eye, because that's what I do for everything. And, um, I don't know, just, people loved Frozen. But, you know, it's kind of an empty. There's just like snow everywhere. It's like, there's not really much here. There's like a couple characters. I don't know. Discuss amongst yourselves. Can't all be amazing critical art. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I see. 
see what, let's see what's happening here. Yes, is it, is it, is it, did we, you're short, you're short of God. Yup. No, oh, it's a triangle now. No, no. Something happened here. Oh, fishtail. I don't think I know that one. Japanese tail for Wait, no, I think I've seen it before. Yeah, Tangled is fun. A lot more happens in Tangled. And there's, you know, color to look at. <laughs> it's not just like blue and white and tones of blue. I remember seeing this game. Man, that's looks brutal. Brain Lord too! Man, Brain Lord was fun. Playing that for a couple years. Or not a couple years, but a couple years ago I was playing it. Um, soundtrack. I can't spell soundtrack. Soundtrack with a D. Can I get one video of this whole thing? It's short. Get it on hold and check this out. Let's give it a look, fishtail. It's quiet. I feel inclined to whisper. Okay, why was that so hard to figure out? Oh, my brain. I see what we did there. I thought that was joined at the... the front. Oh, that's too bad. Dude, I had so many games when I was younger that I could never come close to finishing. Games are just hard. They're just brutally difficult. Finished. Long live the new flesh. That's what I would say. Given the choice, given the chance. Okay, cool. He's a kind of happy boy. Just a little hair. Fancy birds. Taste in birds. The soundtrack looks so quiet. I think it might be fine. Just a mellow little jam. A moosia. Sounds like an Italian. Good bless you. Hey, Amusia. Oh, what was I doing last night? Oh yeah, beef soup. Haven't you been playing Dragon Quest Builders a little bit? I was messing around in there last night. Trying to get past the, the first, first island or um, chapter, I guess. 
It's nice, it's kind of relaxing. Builders, yeah, it's not super, doesn't, doesn't try my brain. A lot, ooh, nice, dude. Oh, Xerolith, nice. <laughs> the end boss will try your brain. Oh boy, cool. So did you finish it? <laughs> I mean, Brian. <laughs> Man, oh man. So I got to the part without expecting it. I went to the part um, where that giant centipede thing jumps out and you learn the spin move from it. I was not ready for that. I was, I was like kind of running around scared. Just finished chapter two. Oh man. Cool. Also a tough boss. Neat. Nice. Well, that's fun to hear. Yeah, I just learned how to build the spiky ground traps and stone walls. And I made all of Cantlin look nice and nice and stony. It was nice that they gave you the ability to sort of reskin walls as stone walls. That was uh, that was delicious. A delicious choice on their part. I was talking to uh, Tigerian Dono about it the other day. Yeah, I was talking to Tigerian about it, and he was saying how he's not sure. He's, it's like he was watching a speedrun, and he wasn't sure if he was into the game or not. And I guess he was kind of turned off by the fact that when you switch chapters, you start from scratch with your materials. And I can see that, but also, as long as you don't forget your recipes, then it's still like you're sort of keeping the core of your progress. Oh man, beef, that's great. Oh yeah, 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 fishtail. I see that, I understand that. Oh, that would be pretty disappointing. Because you're going to be... You know, I was I was doing that a little bit. I was taking some... You know, taking some castle pieces from the first castle and thinking, oh, this would be cool, but also knowing I'm probably not going to get to keep it. So it's also making me not really worry too much about keeping stuff looking su super beautiful, if that makes any sense. And... Like I'm not I'm not belaboring it like I would say, you know, a Minecraft or something that was on a shared server where you know you want stuff to be kinda nice and oh this is the wrong height or whatever. But I still kinda just wanna you know, have fun and progress through the game and that feels good. I think the sequel is supposed to have multiplayer zero lift, but I don't think it's getting added to the first one. Even still, I keep, I keep sort of expecting the next chapter to start, and it doesn't. And I think, wow, there's some, you know, this is going to take a little while, but it's nice. Smooth bird. Let's get that smooth bird hair. Send to let go of what you made. I do like that. a little bit. If you love it, let it go. If it comes back to you, build it an inn. If 
If it hollers, give it dollars. If it screams, give it beans. Yeah, uh, Fishtail, what this is, is a 3D game that we're working on that isn't fully announced yet. We're, we sort of have stuff in production. I can just show you, give you some tours. But it's going to be a game that has lots of animals and monsters in it. Some zombies and some turtles and pigs and slime piles and giraffes and pigs and pig people and griffins and mushroom men and old ones and this guy and gugs sort of like Lovecraft mythos so uh, it's kind of a it's kind of it's not a sequel to our previous game Death State but it has it's gonna have some elements of it but not be the same gameplay wise so we're still working on sort of getting towards our like alpha announce phase but we have the streaming time and it doesn't make sense to not use the streaming time to work on stuff so we're kind of just in like this weird kind of secretly working in public phase, but eh, you know, whatever. Gets the job done. So that is what we're up to. Yeah, Fishtail, thank you, dude. We are very proud of Death State. Death State is our our big baby. Also, we have another baby on the way in the form of Slamland. Um, do I have some? Hang on, I've got some Slamland art somewhere. No, hang on a second. Slamland art. Where is it? Nope, not Death State. Death State is beautiful, but... Slamland! Uh, so Slamland is a new game that uh, Beef Soup Please and another guy in-house are working on, and it's sort of a cooperative... No, it's a competitive like couch brawler thing and stuff. It's fun, yeah. Sort of like basketball, but use your friends as the ball. But yeah, you should check that out too. I'll turn the mat back on. Ooh. Slam it will be coming out kind of soon. Kind of soon. I think someone just followed. Was that Fishtail? Everybody danced. I did all my little babies dance. I like this music. It's a little bit quiet and sleepy for my ear, so I think we're going to switch it up to something a little bit less quiet. And sleepy, lest I go to sleep. So I don't think I'm... I think I'm... Blah, 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 blah. I'm, blah, blah, blah. I'm not allowed to go to sleep on the internet. I'm not allowed to go to sleep on stream. But it does make me want to play Moosia classic tale of Japanese horror. By CETA USA Incorporated. That's cool. Evil and Twisted Viva Pinata. I like it! <laughs> we've, been, we've been busily working on procedural polygon destruction. <laughs> Destroyable models. That would be fun. Vinata friends. <laughs> Eva Pinata. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, someday we'll be able to share the name of this thing, this little, uh, this little treasure. So 
someday. I think we have a name already. It probably will stick. Um, what engine for game development? Uh, Unity. So I'm just doing I'm just doing 3D production stuff. Not really touching any programming. some of the other smarties in the room. Yes, Unity indeed. Because uh, Death State was a Unity game. Slam Land is a Unity game. Zerlith, you can, you can, you can Gway too as well. Gui-Yui. Kind of like that. Dude, how's, uh, how's GDC going? Are you working this week and kind of just popping over there intermittently, or do you have to take the week off? Unity is rather toasty. Unity is rather warm, I would say. Super hot. Good old super hot. Should have a couple pieces to go to the other side. Maybe not. I kind of want the head to be bigger now. I do that stuff. Large headed harpy. Large headed harpy. Large-headed harpy. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Oh, man. Oh, dude, that's crazy. Man, good for Starlight Skies. I feel like she's been really kind of taken off. Sorry about your pipe, man. Pipe bursts are no fun. Just invite everybody over to your house to uh, help with the pipe. Hey, guys. Twitch.tv slash sump pump. <laughs> sump pump, sump pump. <laughs> Boss Claw, what's up? <laughs> also, tasteful burn. <laughs> gentle burn, that's a gentle burn. GDC issued absorbent cloths. <laughs> nice, I like that. I like that style. So that's what GDC is all about. I want to hide. Hide my face. <laughs> Can you get like company monogram shamwows? Like from the swag. Swag stack. Zero with what are we gonna do with that crazy pipe? Well, good luck, man. Hmm. 
wonder if there's any way to scheme uh, for me to scheme some entry into some Twitch Paxies meetup stuff. I should probably check around to see if there's any like community postings or whatever. Because I'll, I'll be at that. Not at GDC, but I'll be there. <laughs> Boss Claw, that's horrible. Yeah, sorry, it's just... It's, I'll, I'll be over as soon as the panel's through. <laughs> oh, man, insult to injury. named Mario Mario clearly it's the simplest answer doubles remove doubles please zero vices wow okay something is up here something mysterious why it's a full face. There we go. There's the normal on this one though. Right there. Interesting. Interesting! Oh yeah, Eventbrite. Oh, that's a good idea. Zerolith, you're so smart! like a smooth bird. Cool. Um, so there's a little thin. Okay. So I don't have a vent bright on my phone yet. That's all good. Got it. Ouch. I used to be able to fit everything important on my like one home screen on my phone and folders and stuff, but now it's kind of filling up a little bit. Tigurian, what's happening, dude? Bird is the word. You discovered it. Use to get it to fit nice. That's okay. Video games on YouTube? <laughs> you guys are really digging this controversial bird. Well, here's the thing. So... Symmetrical hair, non-symmetrical. Asymmetrical hair. This... Let's do this. Ah! My head! We'll do this. Or live stream on YouTube. That, tr that too. That also. Alright, what are we gonna do? Dun, 
Dun, dun. Too many platforms to consider. All right, so. Time to make a bigger bird. How big of a bird is that little bird head? See, the head is almost bigger than the body in the original sketch, and that's kind of what I, that's kind of what I like. Ouch. You're a break. <laughs> Controversies. Meanwhile, on the internet. Okay, we can make this. We can make this bird a bigger neck. Bigger head, bigger neck, everything. <laughs> I mean, birds are kind of. Yeah, that's a that's a pretty good way to sum it up. Tired of tired of all the stuff. So the bird. Harpy head. Head is so big compared to the body now. I like it. I think we'll make the feet a little bit bigger too. Like so. Whoops. Bad bird. Cool. Legs are a little more chunky. Okay, a little bit of that. Chunk leg. Fishtail, we will probably get around to doing some rigging. Um, right now, some of the other artists are doing a lot of the rigging and animation off screen, so we're, you're, sort of, you're sort of getting to see a slice of the production, which we were sort of distributing around between a couple different people. But uh, I've been wanting to do some texturing on here, but I haven't had a chance to get the tablet set up right some just doing some more kind of full process stuff and I think we will probably do that just for the joy of sharing and such harp hippo <laughs> yeah maybe we'll have like a like a hippo harpy centaur thing okay let's let's merge in that hair there it is Subscriber payouts. Yeah, right. That would be great. <laughs> I don't think we've earned that much money yet from subs and bits and things. I think the minimum payout is like 150. Uh, nah. Barely even a concern. All right. 
right, so we're all done with the modifier. Cool, let's stitch them up. Oh, you know what I want to do before we do that? Before we do the modifier, because we have to triangulate this a little bit. Let's... some of that beforehand so we'll have it on both sides. Oh no, I can't see it. Excuse me, eyeball. Down to the way. Alright, we'll see how that how that deforms might be fine. I still don't... I, we might have met that threshold, but it's not going to any account that I have access to. Somebody's having a pizza party, and I wasn't invited. Dang it. Yeah, Queen Amidala, just for, uh, for subscribers and bits and things. They wait until you have sort of retained like a minimum threshold before they do a transaction. Oh, Zerlith. That's... I have some friends, I have some friends that have gone down the uh, sort of, you know, meta level sleep schedule rabbit hole. And oh boy, that's something I do not want to touch. You guys have a pizza party without me. How could you? <laughs> After all the time we've shared. Ah! Ah! Clean Amidala! The Penny Pizza Party. <laughs> oh, you're so nice. Thank you. One fenning for a fenning pizza party. Fennings. Do we want to subdivide this one more time? No, not really. Not really, I don't want to do that. Alright, Mr. Harpy. May I say Ms. Ms. Harpy, I should be referring to her as a lady. Not a normal job, but just like sitting in your sitting at a barn all day, fiddling with light bulbs. <laughs> Some people have all the luck. That's crazy. Yeah, a friend of mine went pretty deep into polyphasic sleep stuff for a while. Where I think the way that one goes is you do a total of like four and a half hours of sleep over like a 24 hour period but you sleep something like 40 minutes every three to four hours. And, um, you know, and there'd be like all these testimonials of people getting it to work and saying like, yeah, it's cool, you know, I have all this time, but also, you know, like my family is asleep. The world is, I, you know, I'm awake in the middle of the night, you know, reading, <laughs> you know, trying to do work or something having kind of weird second-guessing quality of life issues I guess but um, a friend of mine did it for a couple of weeks or months or something and then like fall off of it and then go back on it and I feel like because of it you might have sort of kind of just like just toasted his, his sleep schedule for a couple of years where after that there was just no normal no normal anything happening for a while. 
can go to sleep. Just go to sleep. Let the stream lull you into a sense of deep dreaminess when you twitch hypnosis. That'd be fun. That'd be, that's like an untapped uh, something. Live streaming hypnosis. All right, you guys, who's ready to turn into a duck? It's going to be great. Who wants to be a duck? It worked! <laughs> Someone did the 28 where your sleep schedule rotates throughout the week. Interesting. So you have like a 20 hour day and you sleep for eight hours? Weird. Yeah, I really don't know. You're kinda you're kinda messing around with some some critical stuff. 30 minutes of sound effects on this. Goodness. Gracious. Did I even open up the VLC playlist? Let's do that real quick. Which playlist? Looks too quiet. Too quiet. Is it too quiet? It looks too quiet. That looks that looks better. Blanc's adventure. Nin Sage, what's up, dude? <laughs> Monogamous relationship with sleep. <laughs> it's a good way to put it. Early to bed, early to rise. Yeah, I'm kind of begrudgingly on that. I'm just kind of just late, late to bed. Late to bed, early to rise. Struggle to be a morning person, but it works. It works. This, oh cool, we can. So even though we're not doing mirror stuff anymore, I can select two points on opposite sides of the model and slide them along the edges, and it slides them along their um, respective edges. That's nice. Oh, Blender. Such a treat to work with sometimes. Biphasic sleeper. <laughs> yeah, it's funny too, thinking about all these, uh, you know, I don't know, what you call it? Like quote unquote life hacks and things? <laughs> it's interesting. Man, I have a, I have a friend right now who's uh, trying uh, what is it, like, keto something something diet where he only eats, like, fats and proteins and doesn't eat any carbohydrates or whatever? Because it's supposed to, like, brainify you in a, in a brainy way. And, uh, I don't know, that's, that's, that's great. But I don't, I don't think I could, um, I think I could do that. Especially being vegetarian, too. But also, I just find it just... I'm just not really interested at all in that. My mind kind of goes to, let me just like function normally <laughs> for like a day or a week or something. <laughs> let me just, let me just remember everything on a given day that needs to be remembered and I'll be delighted. Fishtail, take it easy, dude. Oh man, mapping a shoe. It's, I'm sure it's a killer shoe, though. Can you shoe us a screenshot of said shoe? I've got a heartbeat. Harpy, 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 harpy. harpy. Um, I kind of want. Yeah, 
Yeah, Fishtail, thank you very much. I appreciate it, dude. Hope to see you around again sometime. We are here three times a week. Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday. Yeah, we do, we do have a good time. A winged shoe, nice. That's cool. Oh my gosh, let's sketch out a hippo. Oh man, evolutionary stages. Um, interesting. I, would, I don't know if I was even really planning on doing that. As far as, you know, are, like, are you saying so, like, the, the pig, the boar, and then, like, the man-boar sort of being stages of one another? That's cool. I wasn't re even really thinking that. Um, but yes, yeah, we are making uh, Switch Pokemon, by the way. <laughs> no, that would be crazy. Noise might be a little bit low. Yeah, fishtail, that's great. Keep growing that keep growing that Twitch creative community. He's a bit low. <laughs> yeah. Little ham! Ah, oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah, I kind of um what we might do. I might leave the geometry as it is right now, but then we treat we might do the angling in the the rigging state i'm not sure if that if we should do that yeah because it is a little bit you know our flow is sort of at an angle and then we have like these horizontal wings but for some reason in my mind having the horizontal wings and then sort of applying a little twist might um make it Easier to rig later, but it would be also easier just to rotate the wings around. But I'm not sure if we'll do that. What should we do? What should we do? I just want to do a just like a dry fit and see. Yeah. That might be fine. Just do give him a little tilt. I think that little vertex at the back can get a little bit of a nudge. <laughs> Failed Pidgey. I know. Rude Pidgey. This is sort of like street Pidgey. Don't don't mess with this Pidgey. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm liking all the theories that are coming out of all. <laughs> and Sage is like, I think they're making the next. I think they're making Pokemon Switch. I think they're making Evil V Pinata. Hmm. What's it? Who's gonna, who's gonna win? Who's gonna win the concept lottery? If anybody guesses it, I'll buy you a can of beans. How does that sound? But if you do guess it, I won't be able to tell you you guessed it until we announce it. But I'll remember. Up here in my protein-filled brain. Oh, my face still hurts. I don't know what the deal is with that. <laughs> Sarah, that's so violent. I love it. Yeah, a little ham. I don't get to do 3D as much as I get to do 2D. So for me, this is kind of still like, wee, what am I doing? But um, still feels good. 2D is still my wheelhouse, but 3D is, you know, fun to do whenever I can do it. Make sure this didn't get too tall. Yeah, it's still about as tall as the chest of a person. That's a good height. That's a good height, my friend. All right, Photoshop.
We need a hippopotamus. Poptominominus. <laughs> That's how I might like my birds. <laughs> Man, what a way to be. Okay, wait, is the tablet not even plugged in? That would it would help if um help if the other end of this cable was plugged in. That'll do it! Man, everybody's always unplugging my stuff! Come on, guys. Roommates, lol. Pretty much. Anything? Anything? Bueller? Bueller? Well, little ham, it's 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 weird. It's vague. You can ask you can ask questions, and I can um, maybe answer them. But yeah, we can we can sort of talk about it. It's a little bit. It's a little bit secret. It's a little bit vague. I know that doesn't really help a lot. Still, yep, still no pressure sensitivity here. Who's paying me to do this? My bosses. Definitely, definitely not. Definitely not self-supporting by uh, Twitch revenue. I'll tell you that much. Oy. I knew it. <laughs> oh man. All right, hippo. Do we have the other? We've got rhinoceros spot. Hippos. Clean. Oh man, penny by penny. <laughs> Sensitivity. So probably I'm just gonna doodle a hippo first and then I'll go look at some reference. I'm wondering if it's some sort of collectible creatures type of game, since it seems to be quite a lot of them. Uh, do, 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 do. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's literally like a Pokemon thing, but you will probably be sort of endeavoring to, you know, have some, have some animals and monsters, and then also to, you know, sort of progress up some kind of a some kind of a tree if you will to be able to have new monsters and animals and things ooblets yeah i haven't really you know as for everything that i've seen about ooblets i don't really understand the gameplay of ooblets like what what is ooblets going to be other than like a cute dancing thing i'm sure it's going to be fine it's going to be great but What does a hippo look like? Hippopotamus. Oh, wait, what was that? What is that? That's a long word. The long word song. Oh, that sounds dumb. Wait, is it actually a word or is it just a dumb name for a song. That sounds like bullshit. 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 Tire hippo. Oh, Zerleth, is Ooblet's out? Or is it like demoable? 
What am I, what am I asking? Man, look at these hippo teeth. This, this hippo looks like a frog. What? No, I want to open image in new tab. Photoshop or Google image search. You really, really um, ruined my life. Look at all the colors on this thing, though. Oh my god. Look, you think you think of a hippo as like a gray thing. Red machine demon. <laughs> Clean. This is so sad. You look at a hippo, and it's this is like gray, red, blue. Purple, pink, yellow, green. Oh my god. Kind of blown away. Pretty. Nice, 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 Sarah. That's cool. And no, Rainbow Hippo. Also, Prancing Angry Hippo. Wow. Man, these things are good. Um. The back might be a little more. I don't know if we're gonna do just like ball ball construction. That's not super great. Let's do. Yeah. Head bigger, higher up. Yippos. Zerolith, is Double Fine actually, you know, like, producing it with them, or do they just get kind of included in the party? <laughs> Water horse. That's so good. Because that's pretty, that's pretty crazy. Talk about um, nailing the aesthetic and then everybody wants your game. the rhinoceros body. Total Fine's publishing it. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Goodness. Goodness me! Damp horse. Who's <laughs> Juhachi <Jiu> at? <laughs> oh my god, he's so little. He's so little, and he already has stretch marks. What a little baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. Man. Hippos are cool. Oh, geez, this one. This is like a racer head. Right here. Wrap it up in like a little towel. And let it scream at you for 12 hours and you... Question, question why he became a father. <laughs> Amazing. So we're taking a bunch of liberties with some shapes, but that's okay, because that's what we do. Take a damn liberties. Neck rolls. Yeah, those flanges. Hippo flanges. <laughs> Zerlet, that's great. <laughs> that's really funny. It's nice too that, you know, people are just kind of, you know, he's still just like a local dude. Which is kind of a bonus. How many fungers am I holding up? I don't know. So sad sketching without any pressure sensitivity. Oop, oop, oop. It's like using a, using a child's marker. 
Just don't even bother cleaning anything up. Not worth it. Not worth it. Um, yeah, I bet we can do a little mouth shape like that. And hippo mouths are like all the way up here. Like if I'm drawing this like the picture. You know what? That's kind of nice actually. Again, he's sort of like a board of life hippo. <laughs> These guys, I dig it. I want to see hippo versus uh, hippo versus mushroom boy. All right. And bonk music is making me feel all sweet and sentimental. Yeah, yeah. Who's who's winning right now? Uh. <laughs> Old ones are probably just happy to be existing, shredding space time. Alright, we're not gonna do Chaos Mania right now. Dun, 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 dun. I wanna listen to Mega Man 2 again because it's all good. And it won't make me feel sleepy. <laughs> Little Ham is gonna main Tired Hippo. I like this. Commitment! Commitment so early out of the gate! Well done, Ham. Okay. Shaboom! This was one of the first models I did in this whole uh, this whole arrangement of creatures. <laughs> the bear of awesome with snail. Yeah, it is a game. It is an evolution game. You guys are right. You guys are right the entire time. So the rhino's nice because he already got this sort of shoulder, shoulder thick, shoulder thick. But so look at that hippo thing. So we have to kind of shift the weight around because where the rhinoceros has all this, you know, mass above the shoulder to sort of keep its head up, the hippo is going to have more mass above its bum, I guess. safe place. Hello, this is PETA. Yeah, it's me. It's me. <laughs> it was me all along. You can kind of just lose an edge loop there to kind of, to kind of, you know, bring our body in a little bit. Toad ungulate. <laughs> you love your ungulates. <laughs> Have you, I don't know if you've noticed, but Dank got no toes on there. Dank got none toes. Not a toe to be seen.
<laughs> that's a good that's a good stroke to have. What a what a beautiful way to die. <laughs> are way low. Here are these little stumpy arms, and their limbs are a lot smaller, too. Yes. Okay, let's do this. Salt edges. Salt edges. Give us more leeway. Now what? Clean! Thank you, Queen. Oh, oh, oh! Where did our keyboard shortcuts go? We must have saved those preferences. Let me find that again. Add-ons, 3D view, screencast keys. Oh, I have to turn it on. Ah, ah! Ah, it's not just on? My gosh, sorry guys. We had a big conversation about this yesterday. <laughs> it's so salty. Hippo body reference image? Yeah, sure. This is the one that I'm looking at. Boing. This is a pretty baby. So spotty. What's that lip? Oh my god, it's so heavy looking. Is that guy okay? Is he okay? Look at his eyes! It's like, mmm. <laughs> I don't know if he's alright. I don't know if he's okay. Look at his sample lines. And again, too, the colors. Wow. Oh, it's so, it's such a chunk. Goodness. Too much. Too much! <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm looking at this little lean baby over here. It looks so... so little compared to that... big hunk. friend right there. Well, I didn't have a whale modeled, so... <laughs> I had some potato. <laughs> I had some potato! <laughs> Did you have your potato today? I had some potato. are kind of mean and territorial as far as I know like you don't want to be you don't want to be near a hippo most of the time because they um... oh shoot because they will attack 
I think hippo bites are pretty nasty. Hippo bites are pretty nasty. Hippos are extremely deadly. <laughs> That's just a good sentence. sort of help my brain because these quads are so long. Sure. Yeah, they're just, you know, fast, angry. They've got they've got nasty teeth on them too. You ever see like a full a full on hippo's tooth? It's frightening. It's like a dangerous dangerous tooth. Full on hippo's tooth like a tusk. Hippo's tusk. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Wayne, what's up? We're just discussing our personas. It's that time again. Oh, you know, just making making some hippos. I wonder if the legs are get further spaced out. How are things with you, dude? Persona is a truck. They could, that's sort of like a gateway drug. <laughs> first they start you buying fuzzy pajamas. No, first they start you buying a Snuggie. Then you get some fuzzy pajamas with a little face on it. And then it's all downhill. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hear ya. I would love... Uh, oh, some more coffee. I think I'm gonna have to do that. Oh my god, it's already 2.45. Time flies. Gosh. Guess we have been having fun. Sick. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna be back again on Friday. Usually it's Brandon here on Fridays, but Brandon's in GDC, so for the home team. <laughs> Nin Sage, it's okay if you do. Um, yes, yeah, so we'll be. I'll be back on Friday doing something. <laughs> Things are good. Just making a headless hippo, disembodied rhino. GDC. 
PC. And, um... Tigerian is so sad. But also I can do this. I mean... <laughs> Juhashi gets credit for that one. Beef soup, thanks man. I'll come get it in a minute. I've got, I've got 15 minutes left. Um, but also... PL. I'll be doing my stuff tomorrow. Thursday's my kind of uh, head-to-toe streaming day at home. Twitch.tv Imaginary Monsters, so feel free to stop by, hang out, talk about Abixis. We've been working on some enemy animations and getting new game save system set up. And it's gonna be very nice. Well, here's what I want to do. Here's what I want to do. Dang, bang. <laughs> Yeah, it's only Wednesday. Is that okay? You have an extra day. I wonder how this hippo head ought to be. I don't know if this is good geometry or not. That's a big hippo head. Wow, what did I do? I got so excited. I hear you, dude. I hear you. I know the feel of GDC. Yeah, he's really just a little wire right now, but. an idea of where we want to go, I suppose. Are scary. We're just talking about how you know crazy violent they can be. Dangerous, dangerous beast. Um. So what do I want to do for the, the brow? Might get a little bit. The biological term for an awesome hippo. It's one way to stop a charging hippo. Scream, Hippolicious! And then it I'm just gets confused. Alright, little ham, take it easy. We're gonna be done in probably 10 or 15 minutes or so. But we'll catch you next time. Thank you. Thank you for coming by. It's always nice to be graced by the presence of the ham. <laughs> Give me my grievous offense.
Okay. Here we go. Yeah, we don't want to rile up the hippos. Oh, but look at this, though. I'm looking at the sketch. This is so much lower. So I've been looking... So we gotta... I think we gotta come somewhere in between our... Our fantasy and reality. I think we need that forehead to be a bit more, a bit more biggish. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I think we wound up with like a very, a very photo real hippo. That's okay. We'll s let's see how. Slap in the face. Yeah, I can see how that would be invigorating. at the two, three o'clock time. The three o'clock time, yeah, that's right. That's the ticket. Wow, that's schnoz. It's a beautiful thing. Um, one more. Okay, cool. We didn't, we were that far off here. This is good. This is very good. hand slaps too. You guys found me out. Cat's out of the bag. I've been discovered. Oh, it we need to refer to more things of your Yeah, I bet a hippo would charge a car. Pretty awesome. Pretty scary. Okay, so maybe I think we'll come back. We might do a little more hippo time on Friday. Oh yeah, well Wayne, you could make some now and then you could save some for later as a little iced brew. Make make a pot of coffee now and consider it an investment. Chug a gallon of OJ. I don't know if that cures a cold or just gives you like a huge sugar rush. You feel like you're doing yourself a service. I don't know about that, guys. Shapely brew of your. It does look like a car. <laughs> My baby, what happened? 
my child. Mm -mm -mm. Let's stick eyeballs on it. Call it a day. Oh, Boom. Doing. In there. Full lid. I know I've got that eye somewhere else. I need that full shape. <laughs> Snout is killing me. Look at this thing. What? What are we doing? What is he? What's his reason? What's his primary focus? Maybe we can get away with this wire too. Hmm. Ah. Oh, nice. That's it. I might extrude one more time from the mouth just to have a little more roundage. That's too much. band okay. uh let's just do some some cool goodbye music best band name I can see how that I can see how that would be a hit ah oh, shit Well, we'll figure that all out. It's kind of, um, kind of looks, you know, kind of big, dumb, and cartoonish, which I guess is okay. The strange shrew. <laughs> of all the things. Of all the things. I'm <laughs> kind of strange shrew. Good little roundish nose. All right. Anyway, just leave it at that for now. Might turn up the smoothness on this. Increase the smoothness. Oh, it's only a forty. Yeah, sixty. Sixty degrees of smoothness, please. That's it. Bigger eyes too. So the eyes need to be out here. They just need to be wider for this thing to be good. And let's just give ourselves some forehead to accommodate that, which probably means we want to make the snout of this guy bigger overall. So we'll fix the boxiness of stuff. It's very kind of cubey. We'll get there. <laughs> A mental image of hippo is heavily reliant on the teeth. It might be. We'll get there. I think once we get like a little mouth kind of scribbled on there too, that'll help. Oh, Wayne being the perpetual Wayne. <laughs> that meme makes me a little sad because I don't know. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want Wayne to be associated with the something that could be maybe considered a negative thing. Um. Ba 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 ba. Let's host drunk devs. Day off, pants off. Let's host drunk devs. He's not wearing pants. So, H O S T. Drunk devs. Do that. So, again, my name is Pete. Bread machine. Twitch.tv. Bread machine. Go. We will be back on Friday. Thank you guys for hanging out. You're awesome. 
uh, give us a follow if you wish. That would be super cool. And um, yeah, I stream on twitch.tv slash monsters. I'll be streaming a bunch tomorrow. Stop by, come back here on Friday. Just, uh, you know, hang out. And Wayne, don't be sad. We're not gonna make, <laughs> we won't make that a running thing. I don't want you to be sad. We won't make you sad. But check out the Drunk Devs host in just a moment. And I hope you guys have an awesome day. We will catch you later. <laughs> the only way around. When Wayne wins, everyone loses. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> we'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.